Spooky, scary skeletons and shivers down your spine. Shrieking skull will shock your soul and seal your doom tonight. Hey guys, it's Nick from this here, and today I'm going to be bringing you my first Mortal Kombat video of 2019. So, I mean, Happy New Year, everybody. I hope you guys had a great holidays. I hope they were safe. I had a great holiday, and it's even better now that we're closer to the Mortal Kombat 11 gameplay. Now, with new renders that have come out with Raiden and Shao Kahn here, a lot of people have been talking about the weapons, and even since the Mortal Kombat 11 reveal trailer, people have been thinking weapons will be making a return, since in the trailer, Scorpion and Raiden both use a weapon. Now, for Scorpion, that's normal, but Raiden hasn't had a staff since Armageddon, so that's definitely something to be noted. And in Mortal Kombat X's reveal trailer, it had a lot of hints for gameplay that ended up being in the main game, like interactable environments, and the return of X-rays, etc. So, I mean, I can really see Mortal Kombat 11's reveal trailer doing the same thing. As you can see in the new renders, it shows Raiden with his staff. So I'm thinking that they are going to do it similarly to when the 3D era games had every character with a weapon of some type. I think every character on the roster will have one weapon-based variation, but that's just my guess. Let me know if you think weapons should be brought back for every character, or if you would rather that just be left in the past with the old games. People also seem to think that that's going to be a bad idea since characters like Johnny Cage, if they do return from Mortal Kombat 11, never really had weapons, but in the 3D era games, Johnny Cage had nunchucks. Now, whether or not that's fitting to his character, that can be argued, but I mean, they don't have to use the same weapons from the old games. They can just take the concept and make it better. Anyways, the last thing I want to say in this video is there's this wicked YouTuber that I found recently named SixTuber Productions. He does a lot of awesome Mortal Kombat videos and he knows his stuff, so I suggest you guys subscribe to his channel. Anyways, thanks for watching. As always, this has been Necrimus. See you later. Let's see how he likes a Kamehameha!